Hello everyone and welcome to another gameplay in Euro Truck Simulator 2. We are in Pro Mode 2.63 today. We're going to transport disinfectant, disinfectant, disinfectant from Munich to London. I'm picking a freight market job. I'm not on a multiplayer mode today. And uh, let's deliver from, I've never recorded uh, or played or transported something since we are stuck with multiplayer. So let's do something in the, let's transport something in which you can say the official modes, <laughs> the single player modes. Thank you so much to all of you. I hope you're enjoying the World Cup. Uh, the day I'm recording this video, we have had two, I would say, two surprises uh, from um, every team in the World Cup is do deserve to be there. To have seen surprises, so the day I'm recording this. Japan did something great <laughs> and also Saudi Arabia did amazing too so it's it's a good World Cup and I hope you're enjoying uh, let's see we're going to drive 1065 kilometers here in Promotes 2.63 from Munich Germany all the way to uh, London in the UK I do love the road that they have picked for us. A lot of the roads here, they are the new ones in Pro Mods. So that's why I picked something. I saw this job and I decided let's pick this one. Let's start the driving. We need to refuel along the way. We have 281 liters. That will not be enough to cover the whole journey. We are on the <laughs> on the wrong side. We should be on this side here to avoid confusing other drivers. Okay, oh we have a green light. Let's move. I want to see the details, sixteen tons of a uh, disinfectant that's not heavy going to take this turn i'm back uh, in my scanner we're going to uh drive this a lot <laughs> i've been using for the past few weeks i've been using different tracks in the game and we have not given much attention to the scanner this month. But uh, next month we will, during the uh, Christmas drives. We're so close to Christmas. And I'm hoping we'll get an event. So, in terms of the speed maybe something like 140 kilometers per hour let's drive it's empty There we go, perfect. I'm enjoying the World Cup myself. 
and i'm thinking by the time uh we get to see all the group stage matches seems like we may have a few surprises on the way <laughs> Although I'll say I was not expecting what Saudi Arabia did. That was impressive. That was great. And amazing too. Let's do 120. And then I'm recording this after the match between uh, Costa Rica and, and Spain. Spain, how they have also uh, shown that they have come to play. We did see that from uh, England. Very well, game uh, football making, playmaking, passing, and then as a result, a lot of goals. The same thing with uh, the Spain match. I want to see competition and uh, we're getting that there's that feeling of uh, you don't need to be too comfortable the teams that uh, seems to be the underdogs they are doing very well we've also had a couple of matches and in draws some of those matches I was uh, expecting a lot of goals it seems like it's uh, <laughs> uh, it never happened let's do 140 kilometers per hour perfect we do have uh, BMW on our left uh oh, don't squeeze that. <laughs> no, no, no. Don't do that. I'm trying to use that uh, camera number five. Slow it down. Do a lane change. Perfect. Think we should uh, choose this lane. This one here. So when it comes to the World Cup, by the time we get to uh, this December, when we have the group stages, matches, all of them done, depending on how teams, because some of the teams performed very well in their first matches and others have not uh, played, so until we can get or every team to play in their group or the matches i think we'll still have to wait and see the surprises that are waiting for us i know this place we are in a start kit in germany at the moment let's have a lane switch here I want to uh, get back to 140 kilometers per hour. I've not seen a uh, Belgium play, but they will be playing when I'm recording this video tonight. So 
after that match we'll see what will happen those are some of the teams that they are on my list of the teams i can say i'm predicting they'll do very well argentina was there but uh that's just the first match let's say that <laughs> They still have uh, six points in play for the group stages. Even for Germany, even if uh, they did not get those three or one points during the first match, six more points in play in the group stages. They can still qualify for teams like uh, Saudi Arabia, I'll say, uh, and Japan. I think. For the remaining six points in play if they can each team can manage to get one more win oh my goodness <laughs> someone will be going home from uh, their respective groups because two wins uh, out of three that would be a very very good advantage 818 kilometers remaining we go and uh, let's get back to 140 we're low on fuel we should be ready to refuel 116 liters I'm going to refuel in the next uh, petrol station that we'll see. We'll get 500 liters. to get a lane change there we go perfect we do have uh, a car here the red one can you get close to that car that's it. i'll have to increase my speed oh we cannot be able to <laughs> because we do have a petrol station i don't want to continue with 74 liters remaining let's go ahead and get 500 liters going to get 500 that will be enough how many kilometers we have around 700 to 800 kilometers so 500 uh, will be enough until we get to London so if that let's go with that What is that? Ooh, okay. It's a wind turbine. We're headed to uh, Frankfurt. Um, main and do have a truck there. We could have. I never checked my mirrors. We could have had an accident there. Sorry, truck driver. It's not every day I transport, uh, I do the the freight market jobs, I do love to use our own trailer but we don't have a lot of options when we are uh, doing it in single player mode. Of 
quick lane change perfect I want to see how much you are earning oh you're earning a lot 40, 42,000 Do you have a lot of money though? But it's still good to keep adding something to those accounts <laughs> until you can get to a billion. Maybe one of these days. It will take time because we're still. Uh, so we have like 300, uh, 300 million plus to earn. So it is going to take a lot of time but one day we will get there money that you'll never use again <laughs> okay right here we need to should we do a no I'm going to continue on the plane we are using currently. There we go. We have 666 kilometers remaining. What's the time? 1156. We're going down. There we go. We're going to arrive, let's say, uh, in uh, by 4 p.m. Maybe it's been long since I played in single player mode. I do love multiplayer mode; it's it's very good. So when I'm doing the recordings, I will try to do more of these single player modes where we have the AI traffic. One good thing about the single player, we can do <laughs> uh, over 110 kilometers per hour. Something I love, especially when you're driving in Germany, where a lot of the sections you can be able to, uh, if, if you want, you can do even 150 kilometers per hour. Let's see, let's even, let's give it a try, because we're here in Germany at the moment. Let's see if we're going to get to 150, oh, we will. We're going downhill, so that will be easy. There we go, 150, 160. Wow. Just like that. We have 150 kilometers per hour. It's not very smooth. I don't know the reason. We do have like uh, it's glitching. Maybe it's because of the mods. I did install those uh, the cabin accessories together with. We should do a uh, lane change here. We do have a driver. Perfect. This is the one towards corn. I do have the accessories installed and the replacement trailer uh, add ons from Promods together with the companies. 
maybe that's the cause of what you are seeing oh we are close to corn because I do know this bridge here from uh, when you drive without when you're out of promotes this bridge here on your way to towards the ledge I can see uh, on the bones we have brassons We're headed to uh, Brussels. That's the town I can say I recognize from those on that list. What's the time? One twelve. The distance hundred and thirty six kilometers to Brussels. Oh, at the same time, we are at the border between Germany and Belgium. Welcome to Belgium, everybody. Do you think we can increase our speed to something like 145? Is it possible? Now, let's stick to 140. More birds, let's see. I can only spot Brussels <laughs> from the list of those cities. In Promods, you have a lot of cities that are added. They are trying to make it as realistic as possible. Brussels, if you continue on this highway on E25, let's see. Oh, E40, that's uh, Brussels, okay. Perfect, that's where we're headed. Uh oh, we have to slow down. Then do a lane change here. Take the E40 towards Brussels, perfect. E40, Brussels. One day we'll try the uh, the no GPS challenge here in Promods because we have a lot of cities now. It's going to be challenging. I will try that. Maybe in the UK first because that's where we trained, <laughs> and then we give it a try in uh, in Germany. So we'll do a no GPS challenge whereby we don't use the GPS. We stick with uh, whatever we are reading on these boards and uh, what we can store in our own memory. <laughs> well, I'll give it a try. I'll look for cities. Uh, that are familiar but also because we have new cities in the promos we can try to create something different I'm guessing we are now in Brussels here in Belgium let's do a lane change here ring ring what's ring Going to take the last one here. Perfect. We should be headed towards uh, Calais at the moment. I can't spot a city here, you know, on this uh, on that list. Let's see if we'll see something new. 
we are also getting close with only 362 kilometers remaining we are transporting disinfectant from Munich, Germany to London in England So we do have a board here with city budget. Oh, we're moving too fast. Gent. I don't recognize any of those cities. <laughs> so let's uh, follow the GPS. Let's continue. to change my lane and use the last one this one here oh we're still on the e40 but i'm sure brussels is behind us i cannot see the name anymore so it was that city back there we should be headed towards uh, either Lille or Calais, one of those. Seems like we're going towards Calais. I can spot uh, Calais on this board, so that's where we are going. Two hundred and fifty-four kilometers remaining. Here comes the border between Belgium and France. It seems like we are close to the port. I can see the tunnel. 
Oh, we are there. <laughs> We're going to use the train. Okay, in Calais to cross to the UK. We do have 158 kilometers remaining. That's a short distance. The drive now remaining will be from Dover to London. Let's take uh, not that two and this one here. This is one of the things uh, we see in Proverbs. But when you get here, you have to drive in. That's awesome. And with that, I'll see you when we get to the UK. It will take us 35 minutes, but uh, that's the game. But here it will take us seconds. Uh, let's board the train and see you in Dover. Welcome to the UK, everybody. We're now 91 kilometers from our destination. We're going to London. I never checked the company. Uh, DB, what? DB something. The company that we are going to deliver the disinfectant to. Disinfectant. Disinfectant. That's correct. I'm still uh, waiting for the winter mode because it will be our first time using one. Welcome to the United Kingdom. Welcome to England. 84 kilometers remaining. I think we should do around 120 now. When we're here, we're going to do that. 224 liters remaining. That will be enough to finish the journey. We have a lot of uh, lines on our left. Love to see some trains in action. It's 
So we're going to take the M20 towards uh, the London and Ashton. So we can say, oh, it's not Ashton, it's Ashford. Sorry. Sixty-four kilometers remaining. So the next time we drive, the next uh, upload, I will try and do a promods, no GPS challenge here in the UK. That one will be sweet. <laughs> you can see uh, when they are writing like the names of these cities, we have one major one and a lot of names on these boards. Let me show you. This one here we have Dartford Crossing, London, and Swansea. So it will be interesting to try and locate a city. We'll do. We'll try and do one. We'll do a uh, no GPS drive here in Promotes and then we'll also do another one uh, in France and uh, Germany together with Spain, that is the Iberia, Spain and Portugal. We'll do those two. can see our pain we only have nine kilometers remaining let's slow down finally what's the time oh it's it's 4 p.m we are late but uh, not by a bigger margin The good thing is we have managed to deliver the disinfectant when it's safe. Disinfectant. <laughs> I hope I'm saying that right. There's our company on our left. I'm going to take a turn here. Oh, it's green, perfect. Is our company? It should be here. There you are, perfect. This is the gate. No, they do have a ninety. Oh, do you have? Let's see. I think we should pick the 90 this one let's pick that this part uh, it's not very challenging can do this this is the spot right there so all we need is to reverse and get in there let's do it
Here we go. Let's try this. For the truck today, I do have this. Uh, it's one of the street art paint jobs. One of the few resin DLCs that we have got. to carve it in a, in an angle here as just a small curve there we go perfect like that and then are we okay this side oh we're too close to that wall this is the one Perfect, that was great. Ha, ah, finally. So we finished and they're going to give us the excellent badge for great work done. Thank you so much to all of you for joining me as we draw from Munich to London. The next uh, upload will be a uh, no GPS challenge. Enjoy the World Cup and I hope the best uh, country will win. So bye bye. Like this video, comment and also subscribe to the channel. Bye.